calculating potential difference using energy transferred and charge by kscience.com. The equation to calculate potential difference is potential difference equals energy transferred divided by charge. The symbol of potential difference is a capital V and the units is volts where the symbol is a capital V. The symbol of energy transferred is a capital E and the unit is joules where the symbol is a capital J. The symbol of charge is a capital Q and the unit is coulomb where the symbol is a capital C. We can write this equation just using the symbols where V equals E over Q. Potential difference equals energy transferred divided by charge. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. To understand how to use this equation, let's answer this question. What is one volt? Here's a close up of a metal wire. The red circles with crosses represent positive metal cations. These blue E's with arrows represent the electric current, which is the flow of charge per second. This diagram represents how one coulomb of electrons are flowing, which is the charge in the equation. On this diagram, this point represents zero seconds and this point represents one second. So in one second, one coulomb of electrons have transferred one joule of electrical energy. This one joule of energy transferred by the flow of charge represents the energy transferred in the equation. Let's now use this information to figure out what is one volt. We use the equation to do this where potential difference equals energy transferred divided by charge. We know from the information that E equals one joule and Q equals one coulomb. The equation is V equals E over Q. So we write this down, V equals E over Q. Now we input the data where V equals one joule divided by one coulomb, which equals a potential difference of one volt. So this calculation answers our question of what is one volt? One volt equals one joule per coulomb. So one volt is a transfer of energy to each coulomb of charge. So two volts is equal to two joules of energy per coulomb. And then three volts is equal to three joules of energy per coulomb and so on. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. In this worked example, you need to calculate the potential difference across the wire when 200 joules of energy is transferred when 40 coulombs of charge flows. So as the question is asking us to calculate the potential difference, we draw a box around this. The equation to calculate potential difference is potential difference equals energy transferred divided by charge. This is V equals E over Q. The question tells us 200 joules of energy has been transferred. So we write E equals 200 joules. The question also tells us 40 coulombs of charge flows, so we write Q equals 40 coulombs. We can now input this information into the equation where V equals 200 joules divided by 40 coulombs. Therefore, V, potential difference, equals 5 volts. Another worked example is calculate how much energy is transferred when 20 coulombs of charge flows through a potential difference of eight volts. The question is asking us to calculate how much energy is transferred. So we put a square box around this. 
And the information given to us is there is 20 coulombs of charge flowing and a potential difference of 8 volts. We already know the equation to calculate potential difference is V equals E over Q. And as the question is asking us to calculate energy transferred, this equation is rearranged to E equals Q times V. So we use the equation E equals Q times V, where Q equals 20 coulombs and V equals 8 volts. Inputting this data into the equation, we get E equals 20 coulombs times 8 volts. So E, the energy transferred, equals 160 joules. Pause the video here to practice the keywords. The answers will follow. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. If stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. And don't forget to visit kscience.com for more videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe.